Would you prefer a masculine dog like this one, big, strong, muscular, or a feminine dog like this one, small, compact, adorable, and sometimes with long, silky hair? If you chose the last one, watch this video till the end. Among all dog breeds, some are more elegant, delicate, and stylish, and we could easily call them the ladies of the canine world. Usually, these breeds have long, luxurious coats with various colors and interesting patterns, striking eyes, and graceful body lines. However, these dogs aren't feminine just because of their looks. Their temperament and behavior distinguish them from masculine dogs as well. Probably this description fits best to the Maltese dog breed. This is a small dog with long and shiny hair that sheds very little and usually gets stylized. Her walk is lively and elegant. She's very kind and energetic and well-behaved with people. Although small, she has a lot of self-confidence. Maltesers are the aristocrat of the canine world for centuries. It's said that these dogs became even more popular when women started carrying them under their sleeves. In recent years, their size has decreased even more, so scientists compare them with squirrels. Pomeranian. Do you remember the hit dog of the social media called Boo? He became popular precisely because of his delightful looks. The Pomeranian breed has a charismatic attitude. He's well known from his dense coat and his fox-like face. However, what makes this breed especially glamorous is his tail. These divas of the canine world always want to be in the center of attention. It's believed that Mozart has composed a musical piece for his own Pomeranian called Pimperl. Even Isaac Newton had a dog of this breed called Diamond, who used to eat his notes. Because of his size, a Pomeranian is classified as a teddy bear dog. Saluki. Also known as the Royal Dog of Egypt, Saluki has an elegant body that's distinguished with its long and slim legs, wide chest, and narrow waist. Salukis come in two variants based on his coat, which can be smooth or feathered. The last type is especially classy. It has long and silky hair at his ears, whereas the coat is short in other parts of the body. Above all, this dog's behavior is feminine too. Salukis are friendly with their owners and family, but usually shy with strangers. However, don't get deceived from his delicate looks. This dog has a huge amount of strength and stamina, and he can easily run up to 42 miles an hour. The Havanese. These dogs aren't show ring queens without a reason. Havanese are small and usually longer and taller, and their coat can be straight or curly. Because of its coat smoothness, this dog is usually called Havana Silk Dog. Their hair can get cut, tied, or get dreadlocks. Nevertheless, these dogs manage to look pretty whatever haircut they get. They have a gentle and loving attitude towards anyone, even if they're people, animals, dogs, or cats. So this has made them well known as therapy dogs. One of the most distinctive features of a Havanese is its unique walk. Because his front legs are much shorter, he looks more like he's bouncing than walking. Shih Tzu. This dog of the Ming Dynasty was chosen as a lap dog by Chinese emperors, not just because of their looks, but their character as well. His short and pretty coat and his adorable face is worthy of every kingdom. Because their hair grows around the face, Shih Tzu has been called the Chrysanthemum Face Dog. Although their name is translated as the Little Lion, this dog is not fierce at all. Actually, it's believed that Buddha had a Shih Tzu. One day, some thieves attacked him, and the dog transformed into a lion just to protect his owner. Myths aside, he's loving and affectionate with everyone. Afghan Hound One of the most eye-catching dog breeds, Afghan Hound has been famous for his beauty since ancient times. He has a long face and dark and almond-shaped eyes. For sure, his most distinctive feature is his long and silky hair that could easily suit on the head of a 70s pop diva. Some of these dogs have hair on their face that resembles the Fu Manchu mustache. Afghan hounds are known as aristocratic dogs that are open and friendly with their owners, but reserved towards foreigners. As a typical feminine dog, he's sensitive and high maintenance. A dog of this breed named Snuppy became the first clone dog in 2005. To achieve this, scientists used the skin cells of a three-year-old Afghan hound. Papia. A member of Toy Dogs Group, Papillon is a small and attractive dog with a charming and loose walk. He's been named like this precisely because his ears are butterfly-shaped. 
Their long hair resembles human hair more than dog hair. Besides their prima donna looks, with a little care, these dogs can always look delightful. Pretty and curious, Papillon has been a companion of kings and queens for a long time. Depending on his size, he can be categorized as a lap dog, but his high energy doesn't make him a couch potato. This high-class dog is gentle towards people and children, although he prefers to play the boss with other dogs. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel it's impossible to not be charmed from the eyes and the face of a Cavalier Charles Spaniel. This dog is small, has an elegant body, and a loose walk that gives him a royal appearance. His medium-length coat is silky and smooth when it's touched and sometimes a little wavy. This is a friendly, calm, and caring breed. Historically, these dogs are known as flea magnets. Their owners used to take them in their bed because they attracted fleas and so they could save them from the plague and other diseases too. Poodle. Just as glamorous, Poodle has long legs, an elegant neck, and a straight back. The peak of a Poodle's beauty is her coat. In earlier times, it was exclusively for functional reasons, and today, more just like an ornament. Every part of its body gets groomed except the joints and the chest. This particular haircut gives Poodle the title of the most extravagant breed. However, this stylish look doesn't prevent him from walking very loosely, running, or jumping. Besides being pretty and elegant, Poodles are known as one of the most intelligent dogs. Therefore, it's often called the Einstein of the canine world. Yorkshire Terrier. This is one of the smallest dog breeds with a very special look and walk that shows a lot of self-confidence. Depending from the grooming style, Yorkshire Terriers can look different. When the coat is maximally cut, this is known as the puppy cut, and it's a more practical haircut. However, the style that makes him look especially feminine and elegant is the show dog look, a classical trend where the coat is long until the end of the body that can often touch the floor, whereas the front hair is tied in a top knot bow. Although a little arrogant, his behavior is always mature. It may seem unbelievable, but Yorkies were working dogs in the past. So these were the top most feminine dogs. Which are the other ones we forgot to include on the list? Let us know in the comments. Here are two videos we've picked for you. See ya. Now give me the beat.